G'day, today we're looking at how to shape and how to mold your Akuba. A lot of people ask us on the internet, you know, I've got this hat but I'm not quite happy with the shape. Um, can you fix it for us before you, sh you ship it? Can you bend the or, or shape the curve or can you alter the crown before you ship it to us? We don't actually do that here um, at Hats by the 100 um, because we never get the shape exactly right for the clients, but you can play around with it at home with great ease. I'm just gonna show you how. Now the easiest way to do it is if you have a steamer, of course, a lot of people don't have steamers at home, so no problems, you can use your iron, or of course, you can use your kettle. Everyone has a kettle at home if they like tea and coffee like me. So you just boil it and get the steam coming out, and what that does, if you get the steam and you put the steam around the hat, um, and what that does is just loosens the fibers a little bit, and allows the fibers to stand up. Now this is a particularly Western hat with a kick up at the side, um, but you can pretty much shape it and f form and, and mold this into any shape that you want. So I'm just gonna work one side of the brim and my lovely assistant, uh, oh, uh, one of my, no, my assistants aren't coming in today, unfortunately. They were, they were promised for a quick, um, a quick camera view, but today they're a little bit shy. So we're just gonna work around, heat up the brim a little bit, loosen the fibers. Um, and then once that's done, you can actually mold and press this. I'm just gonna make this flat for you um, into any desired shape that you want. And you can see how quickly with my hand, I can actually reshape this if you wanted the brim to be, let's say, more flat. You can see what I've done in a very quick. And if I do that a couple of times over the heater, you'll see that I can reshape and mold that. Now the same goes for this, um, for this center crease crown. I can actually punch this crown out, um, as you can see, and I could turn it into a round crown. You can see it's dented a little bit, um, but I can heat that up again, the same process, and I can round it. Now, if you want the hat to be really kicked up, for example, some of the clients like the hat to be really like slouch-like, so you could steam it, and then what you can do is um, grab the um, extra hold. That's right, VOS extra hold. Now it's not for my hair because I don't have much hair, but if you've got this hanging around, you can spray this onto the hat and what that does is it tightens the fibers. So if I wanted the hat to be shaped really, really crazy, um, I can steam it, mold it with my hands, and then I can spray it with a bit of hairspray and that'll tighten the fibers of the hat and keep it really nice and shaped for you. Same goes for the crown. You can just shape any of these crowns into any shape um, that you want over time with a bit of steam and a little bit of hand pressure. Hope it's been helpful for you. We'll see you next time.